Hi everyone, this is Miles again. Today I'm going to be uh, showing you a way how to keep your water clean in your hydrogen dry fuel cell. Now, as you can see here, um, I've made I've made the bubbler that I have in my BMW out of one of these jars. Now. Some people are making stainless steel um, bubblers, some are making um, plastic bubblers. I don't really like that because I like to see my uh, bubbler working and I like to see what colour the water is. Now, the way to keep your water clean is this way. I've made, in my bubbler in my car, I made a hole up here for my outlet for the hydrogen to come out. Down here I've made another hole for the water to be going back into my hydrogen fuel cell. Now from this hole down here is empty. Okay. Now when all that crud comes out of my hydrogen fuel cell it is heavy crud. It will probably float up the top here but sooner or later it will come down to the bottom. But most of it goes down to the bottom anyway, and it stays down the bottom. Now all you have circulating through your um, dry fuel cell is clean water. All that crud just goes down to the bottom of the jar and it stays down there. So when you're building a um, bubbler, make sure all your pipe fittings are up high. Okay, not too high because you need to put water up here. Okay. All this space down the bottom, leave it. It's going to have water in it and it's going to have all the crud going down to the bottom. So that's the best way of keeping your water clean. I'll show you my one now that I have in the car. It's right there. All my hose fittings are up the top. And I've got a lot of space down the bottom where all that crud will be falling down. And it won't get mixed up with my hydrogen fuel cell which is up the front of my grill behind my grill sorry in front of my radiator so I've always got clean water circulating through my hydrogen fuel cell I can see a little bit of crud down the bottom but that's okay it won't go back into my car into my um, fuel cell so that's one way of keeping your uh, hydrogen fuel cell clean leave a bit of space down the bottom of the jar for all that crud to fall down it will not get mixed back with the water into your um, dry cell thanks for watching